Welcome back, everyone. We continue to be on the move this Pentecost, and today we have a riddle for you. Here's the riddle. What do these five things on the altar have in common? Hmm. We'll give you a second to think about it. Our first item are seeds. Then we have yeast. We have a treasure filled with money. Pearls, very fine, nice pearls. And a fishing net. Have you figured it out yet? Well, I imagine, since they know us all so well, that most of their answers are like the scriptures. Well, of course the scriptures, but it's even more amazing than that. Jesus says that the kingdom of heaven is like all these things. The kingdom of heaven is like a seed. The kingdom of heaven is like yeast, treasure, fine pearls, and of course a net. There, Jesus goes again in the parables, oh, yeah. in Matthew, very confusing. Because how can any of these make us think of heaven? Well, except maybe these zucchini seeds. That's not fair, it's Pastor. It's going to be at the kingdom. Pastor Wendy, that's and not fair. I tried to find the mustard seed. I know, but I, I could definitely see how this can be like the kingdom of heaven because they grow amazing well, wonderful food that will be at the great feast one day. Well, I know that you're looking forward to your <laughs> zucchini, fried zucchini at the great feast. Any type of zucchini. <laughs> Any type of zucchini. But I think the point is this, is the kingdom of heaven can be like the simplest things. So, so I have a challenge for him. Okay. What I want you to do over the next few days is think and reflect about what the kingdom of heaven is like and then share it. I invite you to share it with somebody else. And then I invite you to join us and hear about how the kingdom of heaven is at work in the world. Exactly. Because Jesus uses simple everyday items and things that we can understand to explain it. And so as we understand his images and, and reasons behind it, we suddenly have our own and we can share. And that's how the spirit works and it grows and it builds and we can continue sharing this with others. We look forward to seeing you Sunday. See you then.